Good morning everyone. Welcome to another nice sunrise here in Bogdan Regis. It is 7.56 a.m. in the morning. And it's currently minus 5 degrees air temperature right now. And look, the sun is just coming up over there. It's absolutely stunning again. I had a good night's sleep last night. Went to sleep last night about half ten and woke up this morning at seven o'clock. And it's so definitely worth it. Look at that sun. It's going to be another nice sunny day for me, guys. So I'm really happy that it's going to be another nice sunny day for me. This is the weather I love. Oh, wow. I'm oh, focused. Look at that, just coming up behind the wind farm. It's bloody freezing guys, but it really is cold. I'll tell you that now, it's so cold. It really is. I'm trying to, come on fan, for fuck's sake. God, so slippery. I'm trying to keep the thing focused. Oh, for fuck's sake, this ain't going to so guys. Now, try and put this here without it falling. So slippery for fuck's sake. I can't put it on against anything. It's so slippery. It's so bloody annoying. Honestly. It's just so slippery here. It really is. So annoying. So far, I think it's going well. It's been going well for me. Excuse my language. Trying to balance this is really irritating. It really is. And um, I don't know how I'm going to do this. Make it balanced so it's nice. But look how flat the sea is. It's lovely. Um, how can I make this balance so it doesn't fall? I know. I'm putting it here for you. Oh my god, it's so icy on here. Up and out. This is ridiculous. So, guys, back to swearing. So freaking icy. It really is. No. Can't go this way, guys. I have to leave it on the bag here. Oh my god, this is ain't going well! Nope, fuck this. This is ain't going well for me. I'm well pissed off. Come on! Some ice everywhere. Oh. Fuck's sake. You can see the wind farm nicely, look. Oh wow, so stunning. So stunning, it is. Sorry guys about the swelling on that. I was getting annoyed that it went gone the way how I wanted it this morning. But look at that, absolute stunning. Still freaking cold though. See my breath. I'm freezing. So cold out here, look at this. This is why I couldn't balance my phone, look. Now how icy out here, look. It's really icy. Really icy. And yes, I know what this is, but there's nothing coming out of it. But I was going to lean it there. So I was going to get you, and I was going to put my fan there with me in the footage with the sun behind me. But that didn't work out, did it, because it's too icy. So I will apologise about my swearing. I did get really angry when things don't go my way. Like with my phone and it goes like that. I get really stressed out. It's such a nice morning here. It really is lovely. It's mid-tide at the moment. High tide is at four o'clock today. Of course, what day is it today, guys? It's Friday the 19th of January. I'm at work tonight from 11pm to 3am. 
on Fridays and Saturday. So look at that, absolute stunning. Gonna be a cracking sunset for me tonight again at half four. Gonna be like this. Cause look over this side. Right up where the sun set last night and it's gonna be absolute stunning later on. So annoying trying to do, film stuff when you've got gloves on. It's so cold out here. But look how flat the sea is, I love it. Look at that, absolute stunning. It's going to be such a nice day today, guys, it really is. Same as yesterday, so I might come back down here at midday when the sun is at its highest. But right now is the best light for filming, you know, for taking pictures and filming. I'm going to be quiet and let you enjoy the sound of the ocean while the sun comes up. In minus five degrees air temperature. Time is right now is currently 13 minutes past eight in the morning. How about that, hey? For footage. Look at it. it's such a clear day. It's so clear. If I had my drone, I would have seen our white as it that clear. Not being funny, I can actually see our white from standing in. I think. You can see, make it out white over here. There's like a big hill going up like that, like long and up. So that's where our white is. If you look carefully. You might be able to come and focus. 
Do you find a better fan for my YouTube? I ain't going to focus for best sake. It's definitely going to be a nice sunny day. Look at it. How high the sun is getting now. Going up quickly. It's such a lovely morning. This is my favourite time right now. This is such a good light, good light for filming, for photography. Look at it, it's just so, so bright and harsh the light. It's lovely. It's, it's so nice, so clear as well. You can see over right out to the horizon. You can see Brighton in the distance. You can see the uh, cliffs of Seven Sisters. We can see the whole of the wind fun today, it's just stunning. You know, right now, I'm actually looking at the sun, like where the sun is and that. It's just weird seeing the sun, you know, when you haven't seen the sun for eight weeks, because it being non stop pissing it down, rainy, cloudy, and to actually get to see the sun, it's it's really, it's made me happy, you know. It really is, I'm really happy seeing the sun today and yesterday, so it's really good. It's going to be a cracking sunset tonight, I'll tell you that for now. If it stayed like this all day, what it meant to be, I'll be back down here. Again, if I'm half three, I'll be down here. And the sun will be setting just here. But today, I've got a whole day to do what the hell I want now. So I don't know what to do. I probably will go home, get the two YouTube videos out from... One video out from the sunset from last night. And then I will get the sunrise footage from this morning out as well for you guys. Then update the pictures to my Instagram and my Facebook. And once I do that, charge up my phone, charge up my camera. And then after that, I might go out for a walk somewhere, you know, start doing exercise. You know, instead of sitting in all day when it, on a nice sunny day, like I did yesterday, right, because... I was tired yesterday, but today I'm nice and fresh. I've got so much energy in me today. I've got that amount of energy. If it stayed like this all day, no win. It's possible. Don't get your hopes up, but it's possible. I am crazy, but I might pump up my paddleboard and go out. Because this condition is idle condition for me for paddleboarding. Just look at it. It's so flat. Not a breath of wind. And these are the conditions I live for to go out on my paddleboard. For people who don't know, yes, I'm a surfer, so when the waves are up, I go surfing. But when they know waves, I go out paddleboarding as well. But in the summer last year, or a year before, I came out for sunrise in, in June, on the longest day of the year, on the 21st of June, the longest day of the year, the sun was just rising up behind Butlins. I came down here at first daylight, and I paddle out, Went all the way out there where the rocks are. At low tide, you normally can see the reef right out there. Then I paddled all the way up here, all the way down to Pagham Harbour, right in the distance, and back. It took me an hour there and an hour back with stopping and swimming in the sea and refilling, having a drink of water and that. Took me roughly all together three hours to get there and back. So I set off at like five in the morning as the sun was coming up. I got back here to this beach by nine o'clock in the morning after paddling it was a good exercise i'm definitely doing that again this year i'll tell you that now but yeah good morning everyone welcome to friday the 19th of this of january not december <laughs> 19th of january 2024 i cannot believe it guys it's nearly been a month since christmas like where the hell that month gone like what the hell Everyone who get the holidays blues and all that, I feel for you. 
could I have had that this month? I've been really depressed, really low down and sad mentally and all that and not being myself this month. But that's normal for January after Christmas and all that. It's normal to feel that way. I'm not the only one who's suffering with mental health and all that. It's a difficult time after Christmas and all that. But I'm happy now because that's out. When that's out, I'm happy when the sun is out. This is the weather I live for. I was born for. For this kind of weather. Just look at it. If I didn't tell you what day it was, and I didn't show you my face and what I was wearing, you wouldn't think it would be winter, would you? Just by looking at that, if I didn't tell you it is. But it is. Look at it. Not a cloud in the sky. Like... It's, it's, I just can't get my head around it. It's not normally like this in this time of year. So we're very lucky, I am. Oh, yeah. You can start... Yesterday, no joke, when I was out in my garden yesterday for about a minute or two, I went out to check on my weather station and that, of course. And not being funny, when I was out, if you out of the wind and that, you can actually... Feel the warmth from the sun between 11, between 11 a.m. and 2 p.m. You can actually feel the warmth from the sun. Now, how do you know spring is getting closer? Because you can feel a hint of warmth from the sun. So, it's good. All right. Today, walk. We ain't going to go on the pier today. We've done that yesterday. So, today, I'm going to show you the famous Botlands that everyone come to Bognor for for holidays don't get me why you want to go to Botlands it's not my cup of tea I've been there when I was 10 years old and not being funny it ain't all that you know it really isn't all that jeez it's cold it's in my breath but yeah, I cannot wait to get my baby drone back. I cannot wait to be back up flying. Oh, I'm so happy, look at this. Not a cloud in the sky, it's so clear. Wow. It's so clear. This is better than yesterday. Gee, it's so clear, I can see a container ship. I can see a container ship right here. Can you see it on the horizon? See it? Big container ship right out there. Come on, focus. See it? Oh, wow, look at this rebel. Wow. Just checking the picture of the thumbnail for today's YouTube vlog. Right guys, I want you to please go and subscribe to my mate YouTube channel called David Evans, please. The Dome Brothers. Encourage me to please. I would really appreciate it. You can go subscribe to my friends, please. And then going back out to Fast Mentor in 67 days to go now until my holiday. So I cannot wait. I cannot wait for this holiday. Going to be better than last one, I tell you that for now. It really is. I cannot wait for this holiday. You know, I cannot wait. Right, so I'm going to lean you on this. I'm going to talk. Put that there. So you can see. Hope you can hear me. So yeah, it's exactly 68, 67 days now until my holiday. I literally cannot wait for my holiday. I really cannot wait. You know, it's going to be a good one. It is. I'm going with my best friend Dean and Amanda. I said to you guys, they are like family to me. They really are. So I cannot wait to see them in t just over two weeks to go, guys, until I'm on our white. And 
Yes, you might think I'm a bit crazy, but I'm going to go wild camping and get out of that fear. Not let the cows stop me not going camping. Cows not being funny, the people go camping in the snow. So I, if they can go camping in the snow, I can bloody go camping in six degrees. Five or six degrees nighttime temperature. Because my tent is a four season tent and sleeping bag. So if they can do it in minus 10, then why can't I? But look at this weather, it's such a nice day. Of course, it's first, it's Friday the 19th of January 2024, and we've got this nice weather. What more else can you ask for January? It's like crazy. People out walking their dog. That dog there was barking at me like 10 minutes ago. <laughs> but the owner said it's all right. You could have got my hat on than that. They don't know. But yeah, just look at this. It's, it's just, it's just breathtaking, this, you know? It really is. People walking past, I'm going to take this off, my mic, so you can hear me better. Of course, you can hear me there, but so people can see. But yeah, let's see. It's minus four. When I woke up this morning at seven o'clock this morning, my weather station was saying it was minus five. Minus five. Now I say it's around minus three because the sun is up. You can start feeling the warmth from the sun. Well, it's lovely. It's going to be a nice day. But people out walking. It's a nice morning for a walk. It's a freaking weekend as well. So happy weekend to everyone. And uh, yeah, just remember, if anyone feeling sad out there today, stay strong. January is, I know it's a tough time for everyone, but we all, we will get through this. Uh, I feel depressed and low down when we don't have weather like this. If it's cloudy or raining, I feel depressed. But now we are only nine weeks away now until spring. That will fly by. As Once we get January out of the way, we only got February to go through. And then after February, it's spring. But I will tell you, it is going to be a very difficult day for me very soon. On the 7th of February, 2024, will mark 15 years without my mum. She sadly passed away 15 years ago on the 7th of February, 2009. 15 years ago. I got a bit confused and said it was 16. But now my brother said to me last night, it's 15. But I know it's feel like 16 because... It's the worst pain you can ever go through, losing a loved one. It really is. Like, I can't describe how it feels. It just... You just don't think that they're gone, do you? It's, it is hard. I will admit it is hard, but... I'm strong. I'm a strong person, and I got through it. I'm 25 now, and still getting through it. But February is the worst month for me, so I will be feeling depressed and no down. So there probably won't be as many... YouTube vlog in February, I let you know. But this is why I'm going now to our white to see my best friend Dean and Amanda and Benji and Tom, and we are planning on going wild camping. So it should be good, uh, of course, but it's going to be such a nice day. Let's see. Sunset today is at half four, so it's going to be nice. But wow, that's just so nice just to look at the sun. You do not understand how nice it is. It's so lovely out here, it really is. He's shrugging, he's in shorts. So nice out here. It is freezing out here, you know. But this weather is so nice. So right. Like, I'm gonna end up plugging that for later. You definitely can see the container ship over there. So we are gonna walk along this way, we're gonna go to Butlands. Uh, along that way and then after that we're gonna end the flood. So stay tuned. Here we go. We'll keep look out because you don't know what people are like man here.
Put that there. So you can hear me, can you hear me nice and clearly? But did you see me walking over there? But you enjoyed that. Wow, well, we've been going really long. 25 minutes so far. Uh, Bogan is a nice place in the summer. You've got cafes here where you can grab coffee, ice cream in the summer. So when I normally go out in spring and summer, I normally paddle out here, go out and anchor by the boy in the sun bay. Then if I get hungry or thirsty, I'll come in, put my paddleboard here, go to this cafe, get myself ice cream or lunch, snack, and then just sit on the beach here, have lunch, and go back out again. Or I even get myself beer for my as well and bring it out. So it's good. This is the prices of food and that. It's not bad. Really not bad. This will be open in spring for March, this open. Right, guys, this is the longest YouTube vlog that I've ever done, I think, in Bogner. 26 minutes long. And l how many minutes left I've got of filming? 59 minutes I can do this video. So if I really want to, I can go a whole hour filming for you if I really want to. But then who want to watch me for a whole hour? I'm boring, aren't I? No, not really. Just running you up. Yeah, a bit of banter on here. So, this is the map of Bogner, all right? It's got the pier there. Got toilets here. You've got a disabled... Disabled slipway there for people who are disabled. We've got a disabled part here by the pier, of course. Disabled part there, of course. Um, right, at the square over there, of course. And you've got the train station there, and then I live up that road up there. But so we are here, right? The public toilets are here, so public toilets are there. Okay, but lens is over here. And this is Holfen Park, where you do not want to be at night time. It's stodgy down here at night. But yeah, oh, this weather is so nice. It really is. Bandstand, where people get married and all that. Oh, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Seeing the sun and blue sky, I'm at the happiest I've been in a long while. Seeing the sun and blue sky, this is the weather I live for, you know. Uh, but yeah, working tonight. I know that feeling when people, when you have five days off from work and then you have to go back in again, it's not all that fun, but you know what? money going in for the money so i've got spending money for my holiday of course so it's all be all worth it and then oh walking on the blink and cycling try not get hit well that will get the views up though anyway but i don't think anyone will actually sit and watch my video for 28 minutes please leave down below in the comments how many of you guys Watch all my video all the way through. I would like to know, please. And also, some of you lot who watch my YouTube videos are not subscribed. Um, so please, guys, I will repeat, anyone who's new to my YouTube channel, click that subscribe button. And also click that notification bell and you'll be notified of the new YouTube video. It did not cost a thing. It's free of charge. But yeah, look at these lovely flats. Imagine living up there in the summer. You wake up in the morning, sit up there, and then you're out on the beach. But probably costs a lot. Probably a thousand pounds at the rent a month. Probably living that, I reckon. Bit right by Butlands. I don't know. You know what? I actually wouldn't mind living in that, you know? Imagine waking up in the morning to this. Like... What, what more else can you ask for? And if I live up there, I don't know how to come down to the beach, take the sunrise picture. I can take it from sitting in my bed. That's a bonus, eh? But those houses do look nice. 
I don't know if they're council houses or private because I do want to move out of my flat where I live in in my sport and living place I do want to move out of there and live in a place like this with a balcony or a roof type like that I'm willing to do that get a sea view, view like there and be right on the seafront I'm willing to do that and work my arse off at McDonald's to pay extra money for rent I am willing to do that Right, we've been going now for 30 minutes, guys. This is the longest vlog i ever done in the UK. I normally do this when I'm in first rent tour because people are more interested with stuff like that. But here, we will see how this video will go. I just don't know what to name this video that will help make me get more views. I, do not I don't know how. Yeah, the famous Butlins, where everyone come on holiday. I went in there when I was 10 years old with my clothes. It's all right in there, you know. It's not bad. It isn't, you know. It really isn't. Um, I just want to... Same I didn't do YouTube when I was little. Because I would have brought you in there. But I think you need a special permit to go in there now. If you want to do filming. You can't just go in like YouTube back in the day. So, I don't know. I will try and make it then, because they will open, they open in spring, they do. They open from March onward for the season. But yeah, it's famous Butlins, everyone. This yeah, the 10 minutes, 10, 15 minutes walk from my house. If I go straight up this way and to my house. But I would love to live in that. I would love to live in that. Just imagine waking up in the morning. Waking up in the morning to this. Just imagine that. But yeah, as you carry on all the way down there, you go all the way in the distance, you've got Little Hampton. I had bike ride over to Little Hampton and back. It's a good cycle along here. But my bike is broken, so I can't do that. But if my bike was working, I would have gone out for a bike ride today. But I could walk it to Little Hampton later on. That would be a good exercise for me. It is a nice day though, so you never know. Yeah, the time is now, it's currently 8.40 in the morning, 20 to 9. And that's where the sun is right now. So if anyone have watched this video all the way to the end, I am really grateful and thank you. Look at that, stunning, so bright. Last night up where my brother lived in Glasgow in Scotland, got down to minus 14 last night. Minus bloody 14 degrees. Are you mad? That's ridiculous cold. Well, you can see the plane up there coming in to get with it. But this is the flight path. You come along here. When they get to Brighton and they turn around and circle around and then come into land. I might go out to Gatwick and do um, plane spotting again soon. I haven't done that for ages. But the thing is, the annoying thing is, guys, you need a permit to do that now. I got towed off when I was up there last time. I went up there and they said you have to delete the pictures and all that. They said you can't take her pictures anymore. You need a special permit. It called for security and all that, of course. But you never know. I need to invest in it more and see what happened. But look at this. Absolute stunning. I just can't get over looking at the sun right now. How nice that lot on my phone. 35 minutes we're going for. I'm going to go down to the pier now and end it. And then this will be the longest YouTube vlog. I ever done on this channel. No, but it will take ages to update. Because it's such a nice morning. I'm doing this for you guys. Yeah. 
Yeah, a bit of history about Butlins for you. If you want to read this, you can pause the video. Ah, would have been a good morning, you know. If I had my drone with me now, it would have been good. I would have flown my drone all along the seafront this morning and got some nice footage. You know what? Looking at that sea, it's kind of calling me to go paddleboarding. But it is the ideal condition for me. It is the ideal condition to his. So. Never know. You never know. It's all dependent. Who wouldn't pick up a month ago? But right now it's all right. It's only two or three mile per hour winds that moment. And the maximum wind is getting up to today is about 10 mile per hour. It was all right. Nothing compared to what we're getting on Sunday night. The wind will be picking up from tomorrow onward is when the weather going to change, guys. So I'm definitely out enjoying today's weather. For fun tomorrow, we are back to typical January winter weather. But at least we had a nice two weeks break from all the storm and rain and all that. So been good. Been some nice sunny days. So been good. I'm slowly coming out of hibernation now. that just glittering on the sea I love it so guys I hope you enjoyed this YouTube vlog we've been going for 37 minutes now it's probably boring you but I'm doing this for anyone and you know what I'm gonna end the vlog down here you know then I might come down and do another one later for you guys. Who knows? I will shall let you know. But it's such a nice day. I'm so glad I went to sleep early last night. At half ten, eleven o'clock last night. I feel so fresh this morning. Full of energy, I feel. This is why I feel like going out for a paddleboard. You know? I actually do feel like going out for a paddleboard chest and start getting back into doing net size again. Gonna be on I've been unhealthy recently. So I'm definitely thinking about doing it, you know. Look at that, it's so nice. What the, how what percent my phone is on? Let's see. 63% my phone is on. But yeah, when I left my house this morning at half seven, it was on 100 and now it's on 63. That'd be because I'm filming. But I'm going to end the vlog in a minute, guys. When I get back down to the table, I'm going to end the vlog. Of course. What am I in it down there? No, it's too icy. Lean it against those groin. Right, I'm going to end it here. I am. Let you look at the sun for the last time before I end the vlog. And I'll be back down later, guys. Of course. Remember to click that thumbs up, click that subscribe button, that's how click that notification button, you'll be now further tight, don't need your video. And I will be back down here later on for more YouTube video. So I will catch you all later. So bye for now guys. Why do I have my bloody torchlight on? Bye guys.